Even though Abuja is considered largely laid back compared to the physical exertion, hustle and bustle that Lagos is known for, millions of business transactions happen here on a daily basis. An irate web of transactions happen amongst different classes of people and businesses and across a wide variety of disciplines involving political parties, trade unions, government establishments and across small, medium and large enterprises, all for the purpose of marketing, advertisement and publicity. These interactions require a huge load of communication, documentation and design, most of which still have to be produced in hard copy. That's where businesses like Boardroom Media Limited come in. Having incorporated his company in 2016, the brain behind Boardroom Printing and Publishing Company, Olayin Koju, emerged one of the successful applicants under the Bank of Industries Graduate Entrepreneurship Fund, Jeff. Today, he's in business, many thanks to the Bank of Industry. The GF Fund is a product of the Bank of Industry that tends to give uh, outgoing core members uh, like a, an opportunity to be able to get a loan below two million naira. Like um, you can pay back in three years' time at a single digit uh, interest rate. And I think uh, they are in their third phase now. And I can say that the, 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 the product is actually a very good one because it's really, really helping young people that want to go into the business after their youth service to be able to achieve their dreams of running their own businesses. And I can tell you that, of course, uh, like um, by so doing, they are creating more jobs because, I can, of course, I can't work alone. And my, other, my, other, my colleagues too that was able to benefit from that loan facility have been able to employ other people. And of course, that is really reducing unemployment in society because most uh, graduates don't know where to go after, you, uh, after school because there's no job anywhere that's sure. But this has been able to help some young people to be able to actualize the dreams of running their businesses. What's been your experience and background in the industry? I've been doing this since I was in university, Joss. I schooled in the University of Joss. I've been doing this and it, it really sustained me. Then I never had the capacity of having a machine. So what I do is I do a design and I subject it to a printing press in Joss that can help me print. And I've been doing that for quite a time, so quite some time. It's been very good. Uh, let's say about seven years now. And how much did you get from the bank of industry? What they did was that uh, they wanted to f they want to fund your equipment, so we had to get performer invoices from various vendors on the things we need. So which they, 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 that summed up the amount of money that was approved for us. So but the distance I knew about was about nine one point nine million to about, but at the tail end, uh, I think I got about one point something million. Uh, I can see every business here runs on generators. How do you break even? Well, we all know that uh, the power station in Nigeria is actually quite bad, but ours here is, is, is worse. But we've been trying and we're still making profit because we've been able to factor this into our business plan, into our day-to-day -day expenses. That if sure, we don't expect to get power supply, so we have a backup plan of running the, 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 you know, the generator. And when we have less work, we try to save costs by putting off our generation set. Well, uh, I must say a big thank you to the Bank of Industry for making me actualize my dream of having a printing company of my own with my equipment. And I'm also hopeful that uh, very soon I woke up, to, I'll run to the bank for expansion because, of course, we hope to grow from where we are now to somewhere bigger in the next future.